This is a very simple and effective water alarm that you can install in your basement, sewer drains, or where your hot water heater is. And you just have to attach a couple of test leads or wires to where you want to detect water. And you put the jumper in the loop function and record a message and when you have water flooding your basement or your hot water heater leaking the audio recording that you made will play back so okay let's see how this works okay I'm gonna record a message so you can use it ladies and gentlemen you have water in the basement Water in the basement. Call the plumber. Call the plumber. Okay, so that's the message. So assuming I have a bowl here, right? Um, it's dry now. If I pour a little water in there, that will bridge the contact of the loop recording, uh, loop recording jumper, and the. That will trigger the playback of the message. Okay? Ladies and gentlemen, you have water in the basement. Water in the basement. Call the plumber. Call the plumber. So this Ladies playback will continue until the the, um, the battery the runs dead. Call so if you come home, you hear the message. Or if you go down to the basement, you hear this. You know that's water. Water in the basement. So. Take the leads out and the recording stops. So how does this thing work? Like I said, this is the 1820 um, circuit board, ISD 1820. You can buy it off eBay for a couple of dollars. I had it in my other video, um, 10 second recorder. The circuit board here comes with the speaker, runs on 3 to 5 volt DC. So you can use uh, two AA batteries in series by a little battery box from Radio Shack or wherever. The uh, default speaker, the volume is very low. So you have to make a speaker box for it. I use a PVC connector, just, just the right size. Okay, I think this is maybe like one and three quarter inches. Anyway, just hot glue the speaker to the PPC connector and uh, I use a JST cable, JST cable to plug in for the power connection, positive and uh, negative. And this is the speaker terminal and this is the loop recording and playback, or actually the loop playback terminal. You plug in the JST connector, connect one side to one test wire. This is just a clip. You can permanently uh, solder something to it. Make it long enough so you can... Gentlemen, you have water yeah. in the so I just trick it water because there's water in the, in the sink. The so plumber. make it long enough so it can reach the area which you think uh, can get flooded and hopefully and I think it will here if it gets flood flooded you get the alarm ladies and gentlemen you have water in the basement 